Hi guys, what's up? I am finally back with Expand Season 5, Episode 4. I know a lot of you guys are excited about this one. This episode is called... Gagamela, I think. Uh, that's how you say it. It's a great day. I got my wall of gay back. I know you're all really happy about it, though. I definitely need to update it with some more posters. I also just got vaccinated right before this, so it's a good day. I'm holding a Buckshot Magnum Brew, and I'm excited about this episode. I know that some of my patrons said that this is the one they've been looking forward to for me to watch. Um, so I'm excited for this one. Let's get started, guys. Not a really long intro today, just because I want to get into it, you know? Um, I feel like I haven't watched in a couple days, and it's been driving me crazy. <laughs> Desperate to watch. I don't believe that Drummer's just gonna, you know, give up on Ashford. Uh, not give up. I know what she's doing is trying not to go back to her old habits, especially because she has a new family. I didn't realize they were all in, like, a poly relationship. That's awesome. I definitely saw there was something with her and Oksana, um, but that they're all together. That's great. It seems like a nice family. So she doesn't want to put them all through that danger due to, uh, like, her personal feelings towards Marco. She let him go. She, he killed Ashford. But I feel like I do need her to go after him, and I think she will. But I wonder what drives her there, you know? <laughs> they think Monica stole the container. I'll set up a I don't think this plan will work very well. When they open the door, we'll take them and the ship. I know Philip's here. He don't want you in his life. Yeah, I know, oh my God, kind of kidnapped, but you left. I think this just gives her the opportunity to never connect stopped. with him in some way. You still don't see it. When I heard him yeah. saying, I literally broke. Uh, yeah, God, this is how it fucking ended. I was pissed. It hit, it hit Earth. I wonder if it was big enough to like fuck with all of Earth or just that one section, but it was a big blast radius. Razor back. <laughs> I'm glad that they get their own kind of like the storyline. The, the Martians. You know? has a squadron from the third fleet. My name's Shaw Pet Rat. <laughs> when I was a kid. Pet rats are pretty cool. I named her Mouse. Oh, that's ironic. White fur, brownie. My sister had three rats. She used to um, climb up my arm and hide in my hair. Whitey, brownie, and... Nuzzle her soft little nose to my cheek. Something. I forgot what the last one was. And she was so smart. <laughs> the rats are really smart. Yeah. Tail I used to put things in her cage and she'd build the most getting amazing used to. houses out of it. One day, I yeah, woke up Whitey and the mouse was laying on her side painting. During one summer. Eyes glazed over. My mum told me she was dying and tried to take her away. But I demanded that I stayed with her until she passed. I sobbed for hours. Yeah, I lost a hamster. And then I stopped. I wasn't going to help the rat, not really. It helped her though. But it helped me. Yeah, I relate. So we're building a coffin for our dying planet. Ooh, the symbolism the exact same is crazy. Thing going through right now. And when you come out the other side of this, you're gonna want to be doing something that matters. She had a rough last season, that's for sure. Like realizing that your planet's. A just going under. I hope you need someone like you to talk to. Oh. That's true. Like, he, he's hell? supposed to be what waiting for his kid. Emergency flight restriction for the UN. All ships headed for Earth are advised to expect to live. So they're just finding out it's been attacked. We still don't have all Dang, look at that blast radius. Estimates put the blast between That's huge. That's huge. Tons. There's been no explanation from the UN as to why they're all... Does she know that she kind of helps? It is unclear well, whether this the people is she worked with explosion on the Martian parliament, got the stealth which happened on the fact that Mars is involved. They ain't gonna lie that. Dang, how many people died in that? Fucking Marco, man. You guys say I'm gonna hate him even more. What the fuck does he do? <laughs> Tsunami warning? Shit. Amos? Chrissy hooked you up? <laughs> yeah, concerning Christian having a daughter, I just totally don't really remember much of season one, I gotta be honest. I really got hooked to the show in season two. I do. So the fact that she had a, like a grandkid in season one, I totally forgot that. Sorry. Welcome to the pit. Okay. I'm trying to remember who we know who is in prison. I'm like, could be Melba, somebody like that. Not Melba, but Clarissa or someone, but I don't know if he'd visit her. Bars and prisoners. We have to. 
This block houses inmates with body modifications. Is it? Can't you take out their mods? Still got their rights. Is body parts is in the Constitution. Connor check. That's what we call a volunteer. He could get his mods removed, but he won't. He doesn't care. It looks scary. Down here. That's nuts. Yeah, well, so is Connor check. Connor check. I feel like that they focus on him and his name. He might become relevant later. Dude, I fucking called it, man. I was like, who the heck do I know that's in prison? And they had this connection we didn't really see. Um, but we saw her call him and thank him for giving a choice to, like, go out, you know, to die. But she didn't choose it. Hey, Peaches. Peaches. I like that nickname. You're not here. Yes, I am, Peaches. Yes, I am. <laughs> Oh, another world. Yep. How was it? Oh god, I like I this. Like I kind of like this. First. Oh, it sounds wonderful. Yeah, till everybody started shooting each other. Parasites began eating our eyeballs. Yeah, fuck that. Giant alien machines came out of the ground and exploded. But you made it back. Oh, uh, he definitely cares about her. You can tell. It must look like shit. Yeah. <laughs> the blocker. See, I kind of hated her, but then when she, she definitely redeemed herself in my eyes, and she was just mm -hmm. doing what she thought she needed for her dad. She did Breathe kill in. people. Breathe out. She's eat shit. Sleep. Feels bad about it at least. Take what they give. Give nothing. That's what he said to her. I remember. Do you want me to leave? Oh, God, I'm getting emotional. You said you weren't coming down the well. I had personal business in Baltimore. This is in Baltimore. He came here just for you, girl. Does he have, he has feelings, or? People like us. Mm -hmm. This world is messed up. Yeah. And it can mess you up. Tell me. I guess I did. You can't. No one can. Hmm. Kind of want to break her out of here. Prison escape? Prison escape scene? What is it? Tsunami? Fuck me, dude. What the hell? And that was crazy. Okay, I know I'm, I'm not ready for this episode. I, by saying that, I know. But I feel like, are we gonna get a Clarissa breakout scene? That big ass dude we saw earlier, he's gonna escape too and there's gonna be something like that. I feel bad for Clarissa, you know? I didn't think I would after, you know, how terribly she acted. But when she talked to Ashford, was like, do you think one good thing makes up for all the shit you've done? What she did saved everybody. Everybody there. So I, she was redeemed in my eyes. I don't know if y'all agree. Um, and she's suffering for it now, you know. And her, his, her connection with Amos, I really like it. I really feel that connection between them. It's a connection I didn't feel between him and his love interest last season. And they only had one part scene together um, where she called him from prison. And I, I just, I wasn't expecting it for one thing, but also I felt the connection there then. And now I see it here too. So I hope we get more of that, for sure. I kind of hate myself, though. I already forgot what the big dude's name was. It was like, is this Harvey the K or something? They mentioned him too much for him to be ir irrelevant, so I feel like this event, he's going to escape and do something. I don't know. I'll have that meeting right now. Ma'am, I'm not really sure that I can... Shut the fuck up. She was right. You better fucking listen it to her. Yeah, strike. yeah. It was an attack. An attack. Yeah, why do you think your warning system didn't work? Because there was fucking stealth tech on it. Hello, is your family okay? Was there another? A second rock just A there. second rock. How, you didn't fucking detect that shit after the first one. Is she gonna check up in her... About 40 kilometers northwest of Philadelphia. Where is her family exactly? I don't remember. But she knows Amos is near. And we've lost communication with New York. At least now they know it's an attack. You both were right. They can't see the rocks. Secret Service will have her off the ground by now. We need to contact the UN one. 
Dang, this is intense. I, th I thought we'd like wait until the rocks hit Earth, but this is episode four, it's already happening. Declarance for searching. I bet she hates that Christian was right. Setting up triage. Nancy, the planet's under and attack. And I'm not abandoning it. Nice. What the hell's going on? The I've always liked her morals. The military defense command says it's possible the entire Sentinel system's been hacked. Did you just swipe her away? You yeah, you mother. Are you fucking kidding me? I went to the academy with half the officers on that plane. Uh, seriously, you're under attack, and up. she can help. We've been black. This is why I hate Earthers, man. <laughs> At least some of them, most of them. That's it. Ma'am, this is Chef Casey on UN1. I know who I fucking called. You fattened me up for years with macarons. <laughs> no. Macarons? Nice. You have to listen to <laughs> Nice. Please. God damn it, sir. I'm sorry she made Yeah, fucking listen to her. I think she will. Down on Earth. I'm covered in Martian stealth composites. Where would Mars? It's not Mars. It's Marco and Aros. Yes, yes. yes. prove it. But right now, you have to trust me. Work together on this, ladies. She's gonna. What do you recommend? She's the gonna. Tower satellites are the only thing they both care about Earth enough. Penetrate stealth. To destroy any more rocks yeah, so Earth isn't How fully destroyed. I don't know. Which is why you have to act immediately. Listen. Retask the watchtowers and the sentinels. Good job, Nancy. I hope you don't die. Thank you. We may have just saved millions. Fuck. That's all that matters. I prefer to think of it as persevering. I have a bad feeling about Nancy Guy. I don't know why. God damn it! I was right! I hate how right I am. I hate how right I am. I had a bad feeling. My instincts are always fucking right. Nancy, you're doing... If you had listened to Christian just a bit earlier... Oh, she's fucked. I just had a feeling this would happen. Even when she was elected, I was like, that she's gonna die because of these meteors hitting, you know? God damn it, I hate when I'm right sometimes. Keep this section clear. I hope they got the message out on time, but fuck, fine, I'm in. Do you know what's happening on your Earth? Do you know if your parents are okay? Maybe that's what's gonna get Drummer to go after Marco, is after she sees how many more people he's killed, not just Ashford. And she was the last vote that let him go Suit in the container. Kind of funny that you're a little claustrophobic. <laughs> you're a lot of work. I repeat. Go fuck Go yourself. Fuck <laughs> Dang, this episode's great. Too bad it's shorter than other ones. Like, what the hell? It's 45 minutes? Ain't enough. What are they gonna do? Oh gosh. If Holland sees that you're gonna be distracted. But she's thinking that too. Like, should I distract him? This is too important. What are you talking about? They're gonna kill her. Or it's a trap. Kill her. Go, 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 go. It's a trap. Is that a missile? They're firing at us. Oh, you made it? <gasps> oh no! You serious? You fucking bitch! They focused a lot on her. I was wondering if she was gonna be like more important in the story and she's a fucking villain. Seriously, if you did something with Roxy, I will fucking rage, man. Fred. They're firing on us again! Fuck me. Huh? The Roxy? The Roxy? No? Fred, my Time's man. The whole net is down. We need to get into gravity. It's too late. Proto molecule. So they're not there for Monica. She's just so fucking unlucky. I'm just kind of freaking out right now. We just got a big major character death, plus Nancy, and a million er Earthers. God, I'm kind of just trying to figure out how they're gonna end this. They're there for the proto molecule. What the hell is that? Martian tech. That looks like a freaking mantis from Black Ops 4 or something. How is Monica like so freaking unlucky? It's just there to pick up the proto molecule safely. You got nobody there with you, man. They're gonna get away with this 100%. I don't know what Monica 
how useful she is. How do you want from me? No. You're gonna take them on by yourself, Holden? Seriously hate you. Yeah, go, Monica. Go for it. Nice. Nice job, but how do you fight this freaking rope? <laughs> Grenade? I know, but then you risk the bottom on you. Nice, jam it, jam it. Good job, Holden. Oh, you just got punched by a robot. Ha <laughs> ha! That is really smart. At least they have someone who they can interrogate. Good punch, Monica. She's becoming very useful. Her character, at least. Glad that there's some more development for it, because I really didn't like her when she was... Uh, last time we saw her. Explain yourself. Too bad. <laughs> so sad. She gonna kill herself? Fred is dead. That will motivate Drummer too. There's just too much at stake. She's There's no way she's gonna sit it out. He deserved to finish what he was building. Is uh, Dawes gonna come back? Or who's gonna take over for him? Holden? You guys can't just, like, not focus on Amos again. Come on. No one seems to know who's next in line of succession. Gotta go back and take care of it. Towers. The orders went out, they're being retest. But no positive content. Okay. That's a big sucker. Shoot it. Yeah, there we go. Okay, finally we're focusing on Nomi. There's just too many characters. I'm like, dang, I want to focus on Amos most of all. And then I forgot um, about Nomi. Oh gosh, a reunion. This is our moment. Still. It's cool to see you again. Hope he doesn't rope her back in with his charm. Believe me, when he told me what he'd done, I was as surprised as you. I thought Philip was a man, but I guess in some ways he's still a little boy. Oh, shit. Sure. Uh, He did look a bit vulnerable right there. Such is the... Now this I did want to be a Oh, jeez, she's... Oh my god. I killed a million people. <laughs> Surprise! We have taken back our place in this system and shown our oppressors a thing they never thought possible. He's observing how they both the react to this, but... Blood. But after tree... The inners will never perceive us as weak again. <sighs> it's time to let the system know. She's so we close to him, she could take him out. But she needs to plan it. Hiss. <laughs> Hiss to him. Honestly, I never forget that, forgive that dude for Tell being me. involved in killing millions like that. Welcome home. Fuck you. How about that? <laughs> She's gonna keep her prisoner? What the fuck? Citizens of the Belt, Beratnas, rise up now. In joy and glorious mm -hmm. resolve, we are free. We only focus a brief bit on Amos. Dang. I mean, he has to be okay. There's like, no way he's not. Otherwise, you guys would tell me to get my tissues ready or some shit. So I'm assuming he has to escape with Clarissa and some other prisoners or something like that. And I don't really know. Like, he could be a Christian's connection to, to Earth so he can check up on her family, see if they're okay. It's just like absolutely crazy. Three... Three asteroids hit, and that's just millions and millions of people dead. And that's a victory according to Marco and Philip. And Nobi's just literally a prisoner now. Philip made that decision himself too, which I mean should show her that he's 
I, he needs his mom for something, but I don't really know what, considering that he's, she's just being locked up. Maybe he hopes he, he can change her mind a bit, and I don't really know w what his mindset is, but he definitely has some vulnerability that he has for his mom. But his overall views haven't changed at all. I just... She's heartbroken about this whole thing. She probably feels some responsibility and... Damn, just so much shit has happened. I can't believe it. And they also have the poor molecule and they can use that as a weapon too. And Wow, I, I think that was the biggest twist of that. That that girl um, who was super cheery, super... Kalle. Kalle, jag öppnar dörren om en stund. Kan du lägga av? Jag kommer ut snart. I just didn't expect her to be the one to betray them, but she was. So that was a good twist, I gotta say. She... Definitely took me by surprise because she was just so nice to know me. She was nice to everyone on the Rossi, and I guess she's just good at acting um, around them, like being normal, because she is definitely the key element that screwed them all over. And I can't believe Fred's dead, Nancy Gao's dead, and it's just everything's shit right now for for a bunch of people. But I like that everyone's gonna have their own missions, like Holden. Probably getting the pro molecule back or something. Um, maybe he's taking the reins on the Tycho because Fred's gone. Christian has to be the new leader of Earth because they don't have anybody. It's just a complete fucking mess right now. Amos is probably gonna try and save people on Earth because he's the only one down there to do that. Or I don't really know where his his story is going right now. But uh, Nomi can definitely get to Marco. She's so fucking close. So if an opportunity presents itself. She's gonna go for it. So I'm hoping that we'll see Drummer, like, finding all this shit out. Fred's dead. Earth's been attacked. Millions of people dead. She's gotta stand up and do something. And uh, Alex and Bobby might just cut off Mars from continuing to give to tech to the belt. Or uh, We'll see where their story goes, but definitely they're on a big mission for... For their own planet. It's just a lot that's freaking happening. This episode was incredible. It's starting off crazy and I really enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed my reaction to it. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.